before I go into the next thrift store, I want to show you guys what I got at Warehouse or the Warehouse. And it's actually just one thing and the rest of the things did not fit me how I wanted to. So I just resulted to one thing. But it is this like blazer. I am like planning on dressing this like up with like some black tights and also a black mini skirt and like a black turtleneck or something and black booties. So I like how it's like black and also blue. And then this was actually $4 and then I had 15% off because I'm a student here at UNC Charlotte. So it came out to be $3.65. So I feel like for a blazer like this and it's actually like still in good shape, it is a great price. <music> I'm gonna go inside to get my eyebrows threaded so this is like the before don't mind my little cold sore that is trying to get better now but can y'all see that they're a hot mess so let me go and get these brows done <laughs> So I got these bad boys done. That took literally like five minutes, I want to say at the most. But this is how they look. Don't mind my pale skin, okay? I'm hoping whenever I'm in Athens that I get some sun at the beach because I'm a pale freaking ghost. I literally look like my Hydro Flask. But we're gonna go to Target real quick because I need to pick up a few things that are travel size stuff. And then after we're gonna get ourselves situated. <laughs> things and then i'm also getting some little travel essentials for example i'm getting this like luggage tag because my dad told me i need to get one and then we don't know where any of our locks are at at our house for like our luggage so i'm just getting like a little lock and then i have these little things so i can put like some of my stuff or the shower and then like my other essentials as well because the one i have at home is very bulky and takes up a lot of space and i don't want that in my luggage i also have like this body wash it's like coconut water and vitamin c it smells really good and then i had to get deodorant as well because i don't have a travel size deodorant anymore because it's all gone for all the times i've like traveled in the past and then i'm gonna get this skirt it's just like so cute it gives me spring break and kind of like grease vibes so i feel like i would wear this in grease so i think this is adorable in the colors they're pastel pastel colors are my favorite and then there's this skirt and it just reminds me like y2k vibes i feel like i can dress this up or dress this down but i like how the bottom is like this and then it's like really tight both the skirts i'm getting in a size small usually i'm a size medium but for some reason in these kind of skirts it's just like if i get the size medium they're too big and like too long but this is really cute and it has a little bow but i'm gonna wear these probably with some black tights that is all i have in my little basket so far so we're gonna go and see if we can find anything else that i might need because i don't plan on shopping tomorrow whatsoever i plan on packing probably later tonight or like tomorrow in the morning time who knows so let's hurry up and go So I'm going to show you guys some things that I got from Amazon that I felt like I needed, especially because since I'm not going with my family for once across the country or across the globe, actually, I felt like I needed these things myself. So the first thing is actually this like pillow slash like blanket. So what you basically do is whenever you have the luggage standing up, you slide it right here. So you don't have to basically be carrying it in your book bag or in your hand. And of course, I got it in the color pink because pink is my favorite color. But for example, that's what you do. So you don't have to be carrying it in your hands, in your book bag, or worrying about putting it into your luggage as well. So the next two things is some purses. And I also have another one in my luggage that I got with my mom at TJ Maxx or Marshalls it was. First, they were actually from Amazon. And I got this one. I'm not too sure if I'm going to keep this one or which one I'm going to keep yet. So that's why the wrapping's still on it. But it's just like this cross body black bag because i want to make sure that i have like my stuff in front of me instead of like behind me if i was wearing a book bag like going to the eiffel tower or like going to go see the mona lisa or something and i know pickpocketers in europe are very very like careless so they're like you know i don't give a flying fajibers i'm gonna steal your stuff i'm gonna steal your passport i'm gonna steal your identity everything so i want to make sure i have my stuff in front of me or i also have this one that's like a cream kind of tan color and i really like this one so much i love the strap as well because it makes me feel a little bit more secure and 
and it also has this little thing you can put coins in or whatever you want but I really love this one the only thing is like my camera can't fit in there and I know that's like oh my gosh like you're being stupid like why are you being such a child I don't want my camera to be stolen okay that's like so much money that's like my money right there so that's why I got this one so I'm like debating on which one I want to keep I have this one that's like a little book bag but instead you have like a little strap I'm pretty sure and then I got this little tech organizer thing from Marshalls it was $7 so I can put all of my cables in because usually whenever I put it in my book bag it's a whole hot mess and usually when I try to take one cable out a million of them come out so this is a lot better you can see that you can put like your headphones like your phone charge and since I am going to Europe they do not have like the uh, plug-ins that you usually do for your phone so I had to get like European plugs I have two of these actually just because I'm scared that one might break I do have wipes of course this is multi-surface cleaning wipes and then this is also like antibacterial hand wipes so I got these so I can clean off like the seats in the airplane and also like clean everything around me because you know COVID is still a thing and of course since I am traveling I need to be cautious and also be aware of my surroundings and the bacteria that can be lying around the airport so I'm gonna show you guys everything I got from Amazon. It was delivered today. I'm just gonna go ahead and open these up. I ordered a black mini skirt and I'm excited to try this on. Hopefully this fits. I got some like hair scarves, if that makes any sense. It's like a headband hair scarf. And then the next thing I got was, I don't know what this is to be honest. I bought another black skirt, like stretchy and silky as well. So I don't remember purchasing that one. This one. Okay, so I got a blade. It's blue. I bought a black blazer, not a blue blazer. But I got the same exact blazer, but in a white kind of cream color. So this is how it looks. And I thought I can use this like oversized as well. I also wanted to get a black one, but I guess I purchased a navy one. And then I got a white turtleneck because I can just put this and layer it under like my stuff. If I want to wear a long t-shirt, I can wear this. If I want to wear a crew neck or like a hoodie, I can wear this as well. So it's just a simple white turtleneck. I thought this was a different color. Ooh, that's interesting. That's very interesting. So I got this little vest. It looks prettier on the camera, I'm not gonna lie. I guess this color just has to grow on me, but it's like a mustard, yellow, orange kind of vibe. And then I got this one. It's like a very soft and like lightweight long sleeve. And it has a collar and it's a little like scrunched in the middle, but you can button them up or down, like button all up or like have a little bit button. And that's what I plan on doing. And I wanted to wear these with like leather pants, but I cannot find any that was shipped in time because I ordered these probably two days ago. So, but I have a lot of these like halter tops and they're like so flattering and I freaking love them. But I got this like light pink, pastel pink. I feel like it might be a little too big. I'm not too sure because this area right here Ooh. so this is a long sleeve black top it has like the little rigged or whatever you want to say like straight lines but then also like in the breast area it's a little like open i don't know if you can like see that probably not but that's how that is so if i want to go out i can wear that as well and then I got some sunglasses because I wanted to feel like freaking Kim Kardashian but on a budget. And this is like so cute actually how they like have it. But I'm not bringing my Ray-Bans with me whatsoever. You got me twisted, effed up because that cost me like $300. And those are my favorite glasses. But I got these. And once you see them you'll be like, oh that's why. Oh. Okay. Now the question is, is this going to fit me? So this is the top. This is the top. Um, these are the bottoms. Just not going to show you how the bottoms look. And then this is like the cover up. So these are like cute. I would definitely be wearing these whenever I go to Athens. But look at this disaster of my room that I just created. And I just cleaned it. We love that. So now I got to like move all this shit. Oh, I also got a passport cover. I'm not going to show you, but... <laughs> So I just got my nails done and I am obsessed with them like no one can tell me shit like I feel like a badass
right now like europe is not ready for it and even after i feel like i'm gonna have to start getting my nails done again but they weren't expensive they were like good price and also there's a student discount at the nail salon it's called venice nails so i'll link it down below if you guys are from charlotte or like live in the university area so i got these they're just like Pinteresty, and then there's like the hearts on the ring finger yeah right now i'm gonna get a covid test because um you need a covid test for travel or i don't think you actually do need one for american airlines and um my brother is a pilot for american airlines and he searched it all up and he already knew he told me i don't need one but i'm just getting one just in case because it is free and since um, my insurance covers it we'll be all good so i'm at cvs right now patients went in to get hers done and then i'm gonna go get mine's next that's the little thing where you go in to get your covid test i've like it multiple times at CVS and you do it yourself it's a rapid test and since we're leaving tomorrow we're leaving tomorrow morning our flight is at 8 25 I want to say to go to JFK so um today was the only time that I can get it done taking pictures in my mind got the sun in my minutes later so patients and i just got to target and we both saw that we got our covid tests and like with the results just now we just took it like 20 minutes ago so we're like we're gonna get our reaction to see if we're positive or negative so <laughs> let's just see this all right once you verify your identity then um we'll both put verify identity okay why does it feel like you said like it feels <laughs> like we're trying to see if we got into a college or not ready oh i've clicked it okay yay where's my Yay! Yay! <laughs> We're going to Europe! <laughs> it's negative. Oh, no way. Oh my god! No way! Oh my god! So, this is my current situation right now. It is currently 9.15 and I'm at my apartment, not at my parents' house where I should be at right now. But I was stressing about packing and I don't like doing things last minute, especially when I'm packing. But I realized this is a long trip and I'm looking for my outfits compared to when I was 10 years old going to Ecuador for like two weeks. Since I'm going to be in Europe for like 11 to 12 days, I wanted to make sure I pack like a good amount of stuff, but everything that's going to fit in the suitcase. So. I'm going to play some music and then start packing because I need to hurry up and get to my parents' house because I want to shower and shave and do like some beauty stuff, aka like shave my face or whatever else I want to do. So yeah, and also I'm still obsessed with my nails. Yeah. 